Manage your photos. In the Select Photo window, select the photos to be included in the album. Choose either from your hard disk, your CD or DVD drive, your pen drive, your Bluetooth, or even from Facebook. With the View button, you can see the folders either in list or icon style. From the top option bar, you can view the photos in different style, such as a thumbnail view, a film strip view, a full view, a list view, and also as a slideshow. You can zoom in thumbnails for a better, larger view. From the bottom edit bar, you can edit multiple photos. You can also rotate, sort, or select these photos. From the batch edit button, you can edit multiple photos. This option is available only for pro users. To select the photos to be edited, say here, you can rotate your photos clockwise and anti-clockwise. Now click on the batch edit button to color correct multiple photos. From the brightness, contrast and gamma tab, you can adjust the brightness, contrast and gamma of the photos. You can also reset the changes. From the RGB tab, you can change the red, green and blue value of the photos. From the level option, you can adjust the tonal range and the color balance of the photo. Use the load original button to load your original image. From the curve option, you can enhance and color correct your photos. Now navigate the photos. If you don't want to apply the previous photo effect on this image, then take the checkbox off, skip this image. Now again, navigate the photos and adjust the tonal range to this photo. To apply these effects on all the photos, take the checkbox off, apply settings to all images. You have the option of a before and after view to see the changes. You can zoom in and zoom out of the photos for a bigger view. Bring it to actual size in a single click or fit your photos into the screen. The full screen button helps you go to the full screen mode. Now save the changes done. Here, you'll see the changes applied on your photo. Resize the photo with the resize option. Take the checkbox on the extreme right of the files to be resized. Now if you want to resize your photos percentage wise, choose the percentage option or select the desired percentage from the drop down list box. You can see the changes applied from the original and new tab. While resizing the photos, quality column helps redefine the quality of the photos. Now if you want to resize the photos according to the size description, then choose the size option and select the desired size from the size drop down list box. To customize the size, select the custom option. Define the width, height, DPI and units. After resizing your photo, use the save button to override the changes done or go to the save as button to save the changes done with a different name. Rename your photos with the rename option or window will appear. From the format option, change the format of the photo name. Change the starting number of the photos from the start from option. View the changes done from the new file name tab. Save will save the changes done. Sort your photos by date, modify time, name, size, type, orientation, selection or ascending and descending order wise with the sort by button. Now select individual or multiple photos from the select button. From here you can see the number of photos selected. This here indicates the highlighter on the photo. Send to lets you send the selected photos to your Facebook account or to your hard disk.